So we have a 2015 STI in our shop for the next few days, and we uh, had it on our lift, checked it out, and from what we saw, you guys know that there's a few differences between that and the WRX, and what we saw is the springs are stiffer, the uh, front and rear sway bars are the same diameter as the WRX. Um, the front end is a little bit different, it uses the same cross member and steering rack mounting system as the previous generation STI, it's not the same as the WRX. Um, has the same aluminum control arm, same uh, Brembo brakes and hubs as previous model year STIs. Uh, the wheels are a little bit different. This is the launch edition, so it has the gold BBS wheels, whereas the stock STI has the, uh, the mesh wheels as well. Uh, the engine is basically the same, with the exception of the uh, noise generator system. It's really the same engine, same engine bay. They moved uh, part of the cowl a little bit more forward for um, a little bit more room on the inside. The uh, windshield is a little bit more sloping. So we were able to uh, test fit our current 14 STI top mount on the car with success. So um, we'll carry that over to 2015. We have to make a few more adjustments to some current products. Uh, right now we saw we're going to come out with a new oil cooler kit for the 2015 STI only a new cold air intake, a new race intake for the STI, only for the STI specific. Uh, the radiator, radiator hoses, and fan shroud are all the same as the 814 car, so that's really great. Uh, you guys can just order the same old parts that you would order. And uh, other accessories like our expansion tank, our oil fill caps, they're all the same. They remain unchanged. It's Like I said, it's the same engine, just carried over. Interesting fact is, you guys might be finding this out, that when we put this on our dyno, it made a lot more power. It made about 10 to 12 more wheel horsepower than our 2010 STI did when it was stock. So it verifies a lot of people's claims that this car is actually putting a little bit more power to the, to the wheels than the previous model years. And driving on the road, even before the intake, it felt a lot quicker than our 2010 did when it was stock.